has just picked up. The man is alive. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Paducah, Kentucky. Weighing in at 190 pounds. Ricochet! Ricochet actually says that he, he loves to clear his mind and shove out the negativity so he can be fully present in the moment when that bell rings. Well, Ricochet's busy clearing out his mind so he can blow yours. This guy can do it all. The preeminent high flyer in the game lives for the adrenaline in his veins. This is about to blow your mind. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 180 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions. Here we go. This is the match a lot of these people came to see tonight. And with good reason, Michael, this one's been brewing for quite some time. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Ricochet loves the fast-paced style, loves to fly. It's what's endeared him to the WWE Universe so quickly and made him a headache to his opponent. That could happen here tonight. And here we go, guys. This match gets underway here in the shadows of the famed Hart Mansion. Plenty of fight left. Oh, man, I don't know who to root for. That up. Oh, he's bell clap. He's stuck in the corner now. A striking blow. <laughs> oh, what a boot. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Oh, what a doodle kick. <laughs> and look at the quickness by Ricochet. Big boot. Wasn't expecting that. And Ricochet making him think twice. Oh, saw it coming. And again, yet another counter. Monday Night Raw. Ricochet is now known as one of sports entertainments looking to catch him off guard. Ricochet easily gets the shoulder up. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Lightning fast reflexes. Vicious knee. Now he's been put on the defensive. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Some serious damage. Ricochet with the downward spiral. Ricochet into the cover. He's got plenty of gas left in his tank. Might have slipped there, Cole. He's one step ahead there. Great technical know-how on display. 
Whoa, it's another reversal. Legs trapped. What's next? Oh, wow, what power? Thunderous powerbomb. Big reversal. Hammerlock. Hammerlock. Reverse DDT. Hoping to get out of here early with a win. And the shoulder's up in time. I don't think his opponent was expecting that. Man, this has been a great matchup. He's trying again. Capo kick connects. Shoulders down, is it enough? And he kicks out again. Not yet. And look at the quickness by Ricochet. And Ricochet making him think twice. Good night. What a stunner. Attention. The drama. This is electric. He's in full control now. <laughs> Turn out the lights. Got a feel for Ricochet. Looking beaten down at this point. I'm not sure how he's even standing. He evades the attack. Oh, the European uppercut. Producing a trampling. This is a big risk, will it? Ricochet ready to strike. The guy's not human. 630. That puts him in total control. So simple, yet Ricochet with that incredible victory. That was an awesome win for this young man. One of the biggest in his career by far. What a battle. Respect to both competitors. And this I love. This I absolutely love. Maybe you should have taken a page out of that kid's book in your career, Corey. Great sportsmanship. I would have hit him in the mouth. in his glory. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Wichita Falls, Texas. Weighing in at 320 pounds. Limitless King Lee. I have a question. How come you two are so gung-ho about basking in Keith Lee's glory? I can think of plenty of other superstars you would call cocky or self-absorbed or full of themselves for saying the same exact thing. Corey, when you're a superstar who is both as large and as athletic as Keith, you can't help but expect others to bask in your glory. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Uh, Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. He's got kids! So what? And his opponent from Pineville, West Virginia, weighing in at 200.
216 pounds, Heath Slater. I don't know, there's just something about Heath Slater. Every time I see him, I can't help but smile. Byron, I assure you, he feels the opposite way about you. The one-man band got kids, he's ready for a fight. He's got no time for somebody of your type. As strong as Keith Lee is physically, he is that much stronger mentally. I believe that's exactly what being limitless is all about. And here we go, guys, as this match gets underway here in the shadows of the famed Hart Mansion. What have we got here? Oh, my God! Oh, God! Ah, oh, foot just stomping down! Boom, right in the button! Well scouted reversal there. Nothing fancy here. Backbreaker. Time backbreaker. Oh my, down with authority. Ah, oh, snap there. Looking for a little breather here, maybe. Slowing things down, I like it. Good game plan. Ooh. Ah, knee lift. Dominating shoulder tackle. And there's a reversal from Heath Slater. Three. How did Heath Slater turn that one around? Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. That is a great reversal. Launched with a belly to belly. Heath Slater forced to play defense here. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Oh, right up there. Heath Slater just too quick. How impressive was that reversal? Neither side wins, and this is called a draw. Keith Lee he considers himself limitless. With his size and disproportional agility, it's difficult for anyone to argue against the moniker. From Stampede Wrestling to WWE, Calgary has seen some great action over the years in this matchup is sure to not disappoint. Oh, flapjack! Oh, gosh, landing face first. Looking for the quick pin. Plenty of fight left. He's got some more fight in him, guys. Little kick on the mark. Oh, solid contact there. What a counter. And now that one's countered. Backbreaker. Time backbreaker. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. Two. And there's a reversal from Slater. Breaker. Picture. How did Heath Slater turn that one around? Five. Six. Seven. Heath Slater knows this business is mental as much as physical. This is some great offense by Heath Slater. And he's heading back in. Set up for the egg sweep. Nicely done. Three. Four. Oh, 
Ouch. Kick right to the gut. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Six. Oof. Boom. <laughs> Seven. Ooh, what impact. Heath Slater getting put in check here. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. One. Neck breaker. Two. Three. Too Four. quick to catch him there. And there's a reversal from Heath Slater. Gets him with a counter. Wow, what a sequence. Two. Three. Four. One. Big forearm smash. the suplex. He's on his heels a bit now. He's getting beaten up out there, but staying strong. Dangerous situation here, guys. Downright treacherous. When you look at this, it looks like they both did their homework heading into this one. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Launched with a belly to belly. He Slater. Oh, what impact. Can he score the pin? Slater. There's another look. Here we go. Here is your winner, P. And that's a win to start off the night. This win is exactly why so many superstars hope their number never gets called to face this guy. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. It's riot time! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Lafayette, Indiana, Ruby Riot! Here comes a troublemaker. Ruby Riot has been knocking stuff over backstage all day. This young woman has nearly a decade of experience already, was a top contender in NXT. Wyatt is destined for big things in WWE. If Ruby loses, we riot. Well, actually, if she wins, we're gonna riot too. There's a big hunt happening tonight. And from Louisville, Kentucky, Sarah Logan. Brought up on her daddy's tater farm in Kentucky. She used to hunt for a living and then cook the food for her family. That is what Logan is all about. She also lives the Viking lifestyle. She's a direct descendant of Eric the Red. 
She's been blessed by the gods to be favored in battle. Sarah Logan's a survivalist, a hunter. Logan utilizes her skills to make every woman in WWE her prey. Sarah looks to establish herself as a permanent fixture atop the women's food chain here in WWE. And there's also the dastardly Ruby Riot right across the ring, who you just can't underestimate. You can't underestimate Ruby Riot. I mean, she might like to raise a little hell backstage, but that doesn't change the fact that she's the most dangerous in the ring because of her seasoned veteran status. Ruby Riot going for it. Strong Ooh. kick. My goodness. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. Boom! Did you hear the impact? Legs trapped. What's next? Oh, oh. What power? Thunderous power bomb. And it's Ruby Riot with a reversal. Single leg drop kick. Ruby Riot just too quick. Strong impact from Ruby Riot. Elbow smash. Kick right to the body. Nothing complicated about that one. Devastating elbow. Sarah Logan was just able to get out of the way there. Looks like Ruby Riot has broken a sweat. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. Looking for the quick cover, Sarah Logan. All too easy for Ruby Riot to escape. Gonna take more than that. Close quarters. Oh, what a <laughs> knee. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Ruby Riot turns it around. Narrowly avoiding trouble. Yeah, that could have been bad. Big backdrop. Just rake in the face. Oh, what a nasty, nasty move. Forearm to the oh, face. Oh, nothing fancy about that.
forearm to the face. Oh, nothing fancy about that. Not what she was looking for. And it's Ruby Riot with the reversal. She got out of the way there. Her evasion techniques are on point. Ruby Riot just too quick. turns it around. Ruby Riot just too quick. What power thunderous power bomb. She's got to remember to get back in the ring before the referee's 10 count. by Sarah Logan. She steers clear there. Oh, look at this. Can she end it here? Amazing reflexes on display. She's got some fight left in her. We're going to take more than that.
Ruby Riot just too quick. Oh, and a knee to the face. Right to the gut. She's out of it, guys. Turns it around. Three. Sarah Logan was just able to get out of the way there. Four. Kick to the cut. Boom! DDT. Seven. Bringing it back between the ropes. this match end like that, Michael. 
Oh, look at this, just stretching out the opponent. Almost debilitating. Sarah Logan was just able to get out of the way there. Changing gears as Ruby Riot heads up the ropes. Oh, an elbow drop! Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Saw that one coming. Oh, look at this! Opponent set right in place. Incredible. Two. Three. Sarah Logan did it. Big time victory. This one has got to feel good. Yeah, celebration time. Well, hold on. Maybe we're going to halt that celebration. Why? There's no need to halt the celebration. Look, this is a... Oh. What is up with that? Oh, yeah, big boo, time. Boo. You have a great match, now you want to be a sore loser?
Nikki's on the loose. And introducing the challenger from Glasgow, Scotland, Nikki Cross. This woman is fit to be tied, but incredibly dangerous from bell to bell. And in the moments before and after, to be honest with you. What do you think she's thinking about right now? I shudder to think. Highly unpredictable. I guess that would be an understatement. No one knows what this woman is truly capable of. Or no one knows what this woman is truly thinking. Corey, you would have to think it'll take the performance of a lifetime to walk out of here tonight with the gold around her waist. Yeah, you don't beat the champ unless you go at her with nothing less than your absolute best. And even then, there's a good chance you're going home empty-handed. Lacuz on Raw! Little Miss Bliss! And introducing the champion from Columbus, Ohio, the Raw Women's Champion, Alexa Bliss! I just don't understand why Alexa treats everyone like they're second-class citizens. Because she's better than them, Byron. When you're better than someone, it's perfectly acceptable to treat them poorly. Is that the morals you live by? Obviously, he works with you. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. This is for the Women's Championship. Sold out here. Everyone standing in anticipation to see who truly is the best superstar in the women's division. The women's champion posted on social media today, nothing makes me happier than decimating whoever dares approach the peak of my mountain. Strong foreshadowing words for her opponent. Well, it might be unfortunate then that her challenger possesses the ability to move mountains and might shove the champ clean off the top. For the win to retain the championship! Gets She's got a long way to go before she should be thinking about a pinfall victory here. Ouch! Oh, it's raking the back. Nia Jax able to avoid damage. Using the elbow as a weapon. Boom, what impact. Oh, oh I think we're going to see it, gentlemen. There it comes. Power bomb. Technical prowess from Nia Jax. Reverses, can she take advantage? Situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. Covered by the champ! Very curious move to go for a pinball at this point. And we continue. She's dazed in the corner there. And the instinct from Nikki Cross on display. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Quick thinking by Nia Jax. Whoa, not so fast. She returns the favor there. Yet another counter. 
like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Hangman's neck break. Oh, gosh. Great counter. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. She was looking for. Close line over the top. Man. This with the kick into the sunset flip. Wow. Oh, into a power ball. The champion into the cover. With authority. It's going to take more than that to keep her down. Nia Jax is in trouble. Double knees roll through. We're not done yet. Oh. Kick right in the midsection. Snap suplex. Very nice. To the outside. Listen, full control. Snap suplex. Very effective. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. Masterful maneuver by Nikki Cross. by Nia Jax. This is full control. And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. Boom! That'll rattle your brain. Oh, man, check out this power. And down. Momentum has clearly swung her way. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Oh, and she lands the kendo stick. I think that's the second one here tonight. Amazing reflexes on display. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. When you look at this, it looks like they both did their homework heading into this one. Back in from the floor. Alexa Bliss gets out of the way quickly. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip, sunset bomb. is not the biggest, but she's definitely one of the toughest. Hoisted high above her. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Oh, kick out. And the match continues. She's in full control now. Oh, nice belly to back. That could be a game changer. Nikki Cross. This is not going to be good for her opponent. Oh, yeah, here's Nikki Cross. Ripping in the eyes and the face. Got it. Like, let's 
sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. What a beat! Ah, oh, bear hug. Look at the power. And Nick. And she's able to break out of it. The lesson to learn here, Cole, is that you can never count her out. Nikki Cross. This is not going to be good for her opponent. Oh. I don't have you walking funny. Back in the ring now. And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. And no luck against Nia Jax there. Nia Jax able to avoid damage there. Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Big elbow. And the instant from Nikki Cross on display. Northern Lights. Hit the mark, put into the cover of the title on the line. New champion, new champion. Real close, too close for cover. The size of this girl's heart is simply immeasurable. And now she gets her for a second time. Third time's a charm. Nia has her up. Come on, drop. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Come on, on the challenger. Nia Jax is the new champion. Superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. some very tough competition. We knew it would take the performance of a lifetime, and that's exactly what we got. Wow. There's your new champion, ladies and gentlemen. What a great match. Thank you, everybody, for spending part of your Thanksgiving holiday with us. The rude cheers fill the arena for Monday Night Raw. Things just became absolutely glorious. Can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah! Not from you, Byron. How many times do we have to go through this? I've been practicing all week. You haven't gotten any better. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 235 pounds, the glorious Robert Roode. Can do Monday Night Raw as part of the 2018 Superstar Shakeup, and what a coup! Well, everything about Roode's 
match first class from his robe to his entrance to his performance in the ring. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Flyer X Pac. And his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at two hundred twelve pounds. X-Pac began his WWE career with the most shocking upset in history, was one of the NWO's earliest members, and made history in the Monday Night Wars when he reformed DX with Triple H. And we get to see him make some more history here tonight. A true veteran of the squared circle, Robert Roode is a master of forcing his opponents to wrestle his slower-paced, more methodical style of match. From Stampede Wrestling to WWE, Calgary has seen some great action over the years, and this matchup is sure to not disappoint. Working for control, controlling the tempo. A harsh impact. And the tie-up, make no mistake about it, this is all about skill, determination, and power. Oh my God, pendulum backbreaker. Tick-tock. Gotta be careful not to get counted out here. Ooh, what impact. Pressing leg sweep. Nicely done. Whoa, Brood able to avoid damage. Nice. What a clothesline! Ouch. And he's heading back in. Oh, what a clothesline! Oh, I had that well scouted. The cross face applied. This might be it. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Just a step quicker. And again, yet another counter. He might have been waiting on that one. Watch out here. What's he got in mind? Oh, the dreaded claw to the oh, shoulder, man. Saw that one coming. Oh, and then it's Brew with the offense. Brew's got the pump handle hooked. Pump handle slam. Huge turning point right here. Absolutely punished. 
finishing. That would have been a shocker. Kick right in the midsection. Right now, great reversal. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Oh, impressive counter. It's all right there. Wasn't expecting that. Whoa. To avoid damage. Nice. Buster. Buster. Good way to fracture a rib. Drew's got the pump handle hooked. Pile driver. Into the pin attempt. There's a pin now. Gonna take a whole lot more. Oh, shoulder breaker. Whoa, Brood able to avoid damage. Nice. Oh, and then it's Brood. He weaves out of the way. Scoop slam. He has become relentless at this point. Stringing together some big moves here. Great reversal. I gotta say, I'm impressed. There. Seems like we're back again, Michael. Oh, look at this. Float over neck breaker. Picture perfect. He may have broken free. for him here in this one. What a glorious win for Brood right here tonight. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action.
strong O'Reilly and Fish, four of the most elite superstars in the entire world. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Panama City, Florida, weighing in at 210 pounds, Adam Cole. The Undisputed Era has been nothing short of a revolution in NXT. Collectively, they've captured every men's title on the roster, main evented many takeovers, and have dished out many a beatings along the way. It doesn't matter what roster these guys set their sights on, they will rule over it, and that is undisputed. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we are prepared to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Oh. Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. The monster among men is here! And his opponent weighing in at 385 pounds. Strowman! Take cover, Saxon. You'd be best served climbing under the commentary table. Something's for sure about to be broken. A true force of nature in Braun Strowman. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. Adam Cole is here with one thought in mind to shock the system. The monster among men doesn't ask for permission nor ask for forgiveness. He simply destroys whatever lays in his path. Braun Strowman is a leviathan, Saxton, and sports entertainment has never experienced brute force like this from one human being. What's coming next? Taking their time. Ooh, bullseye. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Braun Strowman. Scoop slam! Big knee. Escapes in a nick of time. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Three. Big boot. Braun Strowman faltering some. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. Four. Oh, wow. What a sequence there from Adam Cole. So resourceful. Five. Look at this. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Braun Strowman. Eight. Nine. He's bringing it back inside the ring now, and he finally gets back into the ring. There is no way he was going to get counted out there, Michael. He's looking a little stunned right now. Yeah, definitely off of his game. Evading possible disaster there. Great agility there. Wow, what a sequence. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Oh, man, what a boot. Ooh. Oh, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. 
Whoa, Strowman dodged that one. Gets out of the way. And fast. Downward spiral. See ya. What does Braun Strowman need to do now to remain a factor in this match? A change of strategy has to be his next move. Oh, right to the gut. And Zagiri finds its mark. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Braun Strowman. Take a trip. The old Florida Keys. Oh, and Adam Cole is ready to go. Oh, the last shot. Tuck him in. It's bedtime. Things just went from bad to worse for Braun Strowman. Adam Cole gets the win. That's an incredible victory and a hard-fought one at that for this superstar. Yeah, much deserved. What incredible matchup we witnessed here tonight. Oh, no! <laughs> Apparently, the superstar isn't done either. No, not at all. The official trying to back the superstar away, but... Enough! Enough! You proved your point. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Wichita, Kansas. Weighing in at 210 pounds. The WWE Universal Champion, Maniac. Big time singles matches on deck here. And Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Bobby Lashley. And his opponent from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty 
Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley might just be the strongest powerhouse to step foot in a WWE ring. Just look at the sheer size of him. Not an amazing physique, unparalleled strength. Incredible strength is just part of what makes him the almighty. Lashley also has impressive speed and agility for a big man. He is absolutely the complete athletic package. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. The almighty Bobby Lashley is maybe the most physically powerful superstar we've ever seen. His build is perfectly suited to in-ring competition. From Stampede Wrestling to WWE, Calgary has seen some great action over the years, and this matchup is sure to not disappoint. Man. Elbow drop, piercing. Lightning fast reflexes. Oh, snap bear. Ow. Oh, what a nasty knee lift. He just cannot be caught. Deconstructing the knee there. Uh-oh. The Gotch Neutralizer. Oh, close line. Ah. Uh-oh, look out. Taking flight. Suicide dive. Like a heat-seeking missile. Look at the height. Famous, Two. sir. Kick to the gut. What an uppercut. Bobby Lashley able to counter beautifully. Four. Launched with a belly-to-belly. him with a counter. Eight. Nine. Ooh. Reverse choke slam. Right in the face. Where is Stanley? This one's a draw. Bobby Lashley has run through just about everyone in the WWE locker room. He's always eager to prove that he and he alone is almighty. From Stampede Wrestling to WWE, Calgary has seen some great action over the years, and this matchup is sure to not disappoint. Oh, snap there. Oh, drop kick with precision. Face crusher. This is going to be big. One. Here we go. Oh, man, what a. He's hoping to end it quickly. Bobby Lashley with an easy kick out. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. 
He got out of the way. Oh, what a combo! He's certainly looking in command at the moment. It's starting to come together in a big way for this guy. Four on right across the back of the neck. Look at this. Snap suplex. And here's a cover. Plenty of fight left. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Straight punch. Reverses. Can he make him pay? Big reversal. And now that one's countered. Shitting breaker. Look at this. Boom. Nice. He has something big planned. Headbutt to the back of the neck. And he's heading back in. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. Something big is coming. What a sidewalk slam. His shoulders are down. Bobby Lashley with an easy kick out. Tried for it early. Showing some quickness. And this match can change that fast. He may be in a bad way here. He's lost much of his early confidence. Shoulders down, this could be it. And another kick out. Gonna take more than that. And finds a counter. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. Oh, here it comes! Way up, way down. What a sit up. Will he be victorious? One, two, three. What a way to win a singles match. Here, the almighty Bobby Lashley should have focused more on the opposition instead of posing. Very nicely done and a very important victory. Hey, this isn't just about going out there and making sure everybody's entertained. You gotta win your matches. And that's exactly what happened here. A will to win was on display. What a great match. Thank you everybody for spending part of your Thanksgiving holiday with us.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship. Drew McIntyre is ready for a fight. I believe a future world champion in WWE. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. Oh! Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I got to say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is going to give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary.
Introducing the challenger from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, Drew McIntyre. And introducing the champion, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, Tom. This is all for the highly decorated United States Championship. Harley Race, the inaugural champion, truly a tough man's title. This is all for the right to call yourself the United States Champion, to put yourself in the echelon of John Cena, Ricky Steamboat, Steve Austin, some of the greats of all time. Over 40 plus years of history for the United States Championship, and a new chapter is written tonight. Great reflexes. Interesting, there's a... Oh, he's in a bad spot now. Yeah, he's got to find a way out of that corner. Knife edge chop. And again, yet another counter. Close line takes him down. Forget about it. Saw what he had in mind there. the quickness. The challenger eating up some damage. He planned for this and could still rally. And what a reversal from Drew McIntyre. McIntyre able to avoid damage there. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. Setting him up for the flatliner. Man, face first. Drew McIntyre's in trouble. Backslide driver. You know what they call that? Something no one would ever do to me. Too quick to catch him there. Had it scouted. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Roundhouse kick. Bam! Line. The champ now absorbing a little damage. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. Covered by the challenger. And he kicks out. Hey, I guess you never know. Freakish strength of Drew McIntyre. Oh, man. Deadlift powerbomb. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. Set him up for the flatliner. Grounded headlock. Clothesline over the top rope. All the way to the floor. Whoa, McIntyre able to avoid damage there. And there's the reversal from Drew McIntyre. The uh, fireman's carry. Four. Right into a spine buster. Five. Into the gut. What's next? All the way up. Crucifix. Oh, Six. boy. Oh, boy. 
Gets out of dodge there. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Launched with a belly to belly. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Up for the electric chair. Down. Nobody wins. The referee has called this a draw. This is all for the right to call yourself the United States Champion. To put yourself in the echelon of John Cena, Ricky Steamboat, Steve Austin, some of the greats of all time. Over 40 plus years of history for the United States Championship and a new chapter is written tonight. Oh, a striking blow. Oh, incredible height. He might have been waiting on that one. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Lutez press! By God, Baron! Just tossed. Did she get airline miles for that? A striking blow. Suplex. Finds a way to reverse. Flash! What impact! The challenger's looking shaken. Taking on some offense, but he expected as much. Drew McIntyre can't be enjoying this. Oh, what a slam! Planted him. He's in control. Slam! Impactful. It'll jar your spine. Whoa, McIntyre able to avoid damage there. Belly to belly suplex. Great evasion. Oh, McIntyre just launched his opponent. Overhead, belly to belly. Proving tough to catch. Brutality. He's hurting now. If he doesn't get out of that corner, he's going to be hurting even worse. Oh. Clear the deck. Cannonball coming through. For the win to retain the championship. He gets the shoulder up before three. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Uh-oh, double underhook. Tiger Bomb for the win to retain the championship. One, two, Ref found a two count. Nice kick out there. And what a reversal from Drew McIntyre. Final driver. Oh, this is not going to be pretty. Oh, no. Oh, haven't seen this in a long time. The old... Driven down from cover for the championship. And there's the kick out. Clearly not enough damage done. Shock. Good night. The title might change hands. But now, can Drew McIntyre capitalize? Yeah, he's not done yet. How impressive was that reversal?
Whoa, McIntyre able to avoid the damage there. from Drew McIntyre. That is a great reversal. Get to the suplex with the championship on the line. One, two, three. Retains the title. Task was a mighty one, but look here. It's how you contain a Scottish psychopath. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE United States Champion. Took on some damage there, but was still able to pick up the win. I don't know if there's anybody in the back that can actually unseat this dominant champion. What a great match. Thank you, everybody, for spending part of your Thanksgiving holiday with us.